New at six tonight, three 49ers players took time out of their off day to bring some joy to a Richmond Community Center. The team announced Rise Youth Centers is among seven recipients of their social justice grants. The team began the program in 2020, awarding the grants to organizations working to spur societal change here in the Bay Area. A very good thing. Our Greg Lee joined the player and the team representatives as they recognized and encouraged these young people to keep working for a better future. The 49ers stepped off the bus, jerseys on, <laughs> walked out, hype music playing, and fired up the crowd. This wasn't the normal pregame routine for these players, but still one they took very seriously. It's my job to make sure I come back even after making it out, making it to the NFL, and trying to help and, and give back as best as I can and let the kids know that they have somebody that's been there and has made it out. Linebackers Aziz Alshire, Marcelino McCrary Ball, and lineman Spencer Burford went to Richmond's Rise Youth Center to deliver good news. The team selected the nonprofit to be a recipient of one of its social justice grants. What's so special about this organization in particular is that it really is youth driven. The players took a tour of Rise's facility where young people of all backgrounds have created a community for and with each other. The staff and youth sharing a passion for social and racial justice. This is a place where they can be creative. This is a place where they can heal. This is a place where they can organize. It's really about safety, right? Creating a container where young people can be their full selves. Rise is everything to me. Um, I had mentors. I had people who just showed me every single day that they cared. Sunny Thomas calls this her family. She brought her trauma and challenges to rise in middle school and turned them into art and a commitment to her community. She now serves on the staff, giving back what she's received. Going back to being that little girl in that time and that moment, if I could somehow manifest her into this space, she would feel so important. She would feel so heard to know that these famous people who have all this money, all this access, who can be doing anything in the world, who just had a game yesterday, will take the time out to be here. These professional athletes took in the beats students have created, sat down to paint and talk, and made the partnership between Rise and the Niners official with a custom t-shirt. For Al Shire, it's hard not to see himself in these young people. Growing up, he experienced homelessness and poverty, overcoming challenge after challenge before becoming a Niner. When it comes to being in poverty and kids in poverty, is there's not a lot of consistency. You know, whether it's at home, you know, for me, going, I went to a different school almost every year until I got to high school. So I think having a place like this, the rise where the kids are kind of leading the way and they have one place where they can come and feel safe and it's consistent for them, I, got, I mean, you can't beat that. Al Shire is on the Players Social Justice Council that helped the 49ers pick Rise and six other organizations to receive this year's grants, totaling $500,000. The money helping these groups advance societal change in the Bay Area. It's our responsibility to support the community in the ways that we feel are necessary. Each organization that we work with um, has their own little way that they support um, you know, righting the wrongs that have been done in the past for marginalized communities. The players signed autographs and took a lot of photos with the young people at Rise, but perhaps more important than a souvenir, a message from a role model who plays for your favorite team and knows what you're going through. A lot of times, you know, you can't see better for yourself. You just see the situation you're in. But the first thing you got to do is believe, you know, believe that you can be better. Uh, you got to make decisions that are going to align with what you want for your life and for yourself. So it gets greater later, but you just got to trust the process. The 49ers have committed $5 million over the next 10 years to this social justice grant program. In Richmond, Greg Lee, KTVU, Fox 2 News.